Hello and welcome to this Packet Tracer tutorial. This is for the CCNA Discovery Semester 2, an introduction to using the router. What we're going to do in this tutorial is just set the enable password and change the host name. So I've just got a PC connected to a router via the console cable as in previous tutorials. So I'm just going to go into the PC, select desktop tab and terminal and then OK. Continue with configuration dialog. I'm going to say no, and let's just press return to get started. So we're just going to move up through the levels again. So enable, press enter, conf t, press enter, and here we can start our commands. The first one we'll do is change the host name of the router. So type in the word host name, followed by a space, and the name you want to call the router. So in this case, I'll just call it Pete. Not the best naming convention in the world, but it will do for demo. So as you can see, the word root has been replaced by Pete. I'm just going to put in an enable password on the router as well. Um, so we type in the word enable, followed by password, followed by whatever we want our password to be. So in this case, Cisco. Not the most secure password in the world. It's shown in plain text on the show run. So there is a better option. And for that, you type in enable secret Cisco and press enter. Still not brilliant, but slightly more secure than just enable password. Throughout the studies on the Cisco discovery, they seem to get you to put them in uh, both at the same time. It's actually the secret that's going to be the one that's used. Even if you put both in, the enable password will be ignored and the enable secret will be replaced with it. In this case, we've got the same password, so it doesn't really matter too much. So what we're going to do is just exit out of our router, typing end and exit, press enter, and as soon as we type in enable, we'll be prompted for that password. So we'll type in Cisco, and again, nothing will actually happen on the screen, so you have to trust that you've done it correct. We'll press enter, and very quickly I'll just show you the show run. I'll go into this in another tutorial. And press enter, and as you can see, my enable password was Cisco, quite clearly printed out there. But the enable secrets is slightly better in that it's been encrypted, um, although not too difficult to copy that out and paste it into a special web page and it translates it back to normal for you. I hope you found this useful. See you in the next tutorial. Thank you for watching.